Hey, what's up, guys? It is Toy Adventures here with another vlog type video. I know I don't do these too often, but I have been trying to kind of branch out my content, so I've been trying to do these a little bit more, and I'm having fun with them. Last time we did Frankensons, and today we're doing something a little more on brand. We're going to be touring the two Mattel kind of warehouse stores located in California, at least around me, that being the San Bernardino store, warehouse, and the El Segundo Mattel headquarters. Unlike the Frankenstein's tour vlog, I'm not really going to talk too much because uh, you can really kind of just tell what's going on. I'm just going to be recording the stories, letting you guys see how the Mattel uh, warehouse and toy store look. And uh, without further ado, here we go, guys. Starting out, we're going to be going to the San Bernardino warehouse first. This is more of a warehouse than an actual toy store. Um, I asked the employees. It's mainly just damaged box stock, so... Nothing too brand new, but still a really cool spot to check out if you're in the area and you like dinosaurs. I th believe it's 40% off everything in the store, so you do get a crazy good discount. And, uh, well, let's just see what they've got on offer. Taking a walk in here, you can see it is just piles of different kinds of Hot Wheels. We've got a bunch of Hot Wheels, a bunch of WWE, a whole bunch of Barbie, and some pretty cool Jurassic albeit a little old but still neat because it's all on a crazy sale so i hope you guys enjoy taking a look around at this san bernardino warehouse and uh i'll check back in once we're at the el segundo los angeles headquarters This place was cool, but for a Jurassic fan, it was definitely a little underwhelming. I'm sure if you're a Barbie fan, you love this place, but it only gets better because now we're checking out the real meat and potatoes, the El Segundo Mattel headquarters located in Los Angeles. And as you can see, the presentation of this store alone is crazy. It's a big old building and it looks amazing. You can see the We Make Toys little sign over there. Just a really nice little headquarters. Hey, look, they stole the Target balls and the Mattel sign. 
walking up to it we actually walked into kind of the visitors area for the building not the toy store uh, again we didn't really know where to go but we got directions inside the visitor center it's really cool you have kind of barbie theme he-man and uh you got the little volkswagen right there it looks really nice it's a nice presentation but we're all here for the toy store and once we walk in it is genuinely like a real toy store there are aisles there are shelves they're well stocked it's all brand new stock and as you can see here, it is most of the new uh, Hammond collections and dino trackers and those little transforming dinosaurs, I'm not too sure. I made sure to get a good old view of the Jurassic Isles, but of course I will be showing off pretty much every aisle in this store. So uh, I hope you guys enjoy. It's a really cool store to check out. Not quite the most brand new stock, like we don't have the new Paradin yet. Yet, they will be coming, but uh, they gotta sell off some of this old stuff first, of course. But. Enjoy the little tour. This was another really cool aisle to check, the Halo Mega Constructs. While I'm not really into these too much anymore, I still enjoy them. And uh, certain releases I'll get if they really speak to me. Sadly, no Falcon. I was really kind of hoping to see that. But they have the Pelican, they have the Hornet, and they have the brand new Hero Series. These are really cool. And uh, most of them were pretty scalped. I didn't see too many of the uh, combat forms. But, uh, well... I did get a little lucky, and I managed to walk away with a couple cool figures. I didn't get anything Jurassic Park here, but I did manage to find uh, some cool finds. And as you can see, I actually ended up getting two of those honor guards and that combat form little flood guy. Really cool new hero sets. Had to get those guys because how uh, sought after and just cool they are. Anyway, guys, that's pretty much it for these two stores. I pretty much showed you all there is to see. Uh, they have pretty nice stock. Nothing too crazy, nothing too new. But if you're looking for some, you know, a little harder to find Jurassic Park toys, I'm sure you can find them here. Uh, if there's any other cool spots you guys would like me to try and vlog at, let me know. I mean, I keep them, you know, dinosaur or action figure related because I'd love to go check those stores out. And uh, I'll check out, catch you guys later. This has been Toy Adventures, signing out. Peace.